In this video, I'm going to uh, talk about uh, uh, one app within Center of Excellence Core Component Solution called as Set App Permission. Now, what it is, it's a Canvas app. It allows an admin to set application permission. So if you have created uh, numerous apps within your WoW Platform tenant, uh, uh, admin would be able to set app permission through that screen. Uh, admin can grant viewer, editor, owner permissions. You can also view the app by owner you can also view list of orphaned apps so think about an app which is created by a user who has left the organization and now uh, there's no owner for that particular app so how do you reclaim that ownership and uh, grant ownership to some active users within your organization uh, you can also search for apps you can also email app makers okay so let me uh, show you how to actually use that app okay so uh, again, how to trigger this app is go into Center of Excellence Score Components and uh, go into the apps. And then here you'll see Set App Permissions. Click on it, click on Play, and then you will be presented with Set App Permission screen. Now here in the screen, you will be able to see, navigate to various environments okay, on the left-hand side. Uh, and uh, this environment, listing of environment, uh, once you click on it, so if I click on this uh, environment, I will be able to uh, view the list of apps created by users. Now, uh, this particular app uh, lists down the display name for that app. It displays the owner, last launched, and the app ID. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, say click one of the app, OK? And then once I click on that app, I will be presented with a button called as Add Permission. So if I click on Add Permissions, uh, it will allow me to uh, type a name or an email address. So I have a user called as dummy one user. So if I click on that user, then uh, I can assign the permissions for that uh, user. Okay, so let me put a viewer permission and I click on that users and I click on save. The moment I do that, uh, a, a user permission will be granted to that particular user. Okay, I'll just cancel that out. Okay, now, on the top bar, you will see uh, owner or fund app. So if I click on owner, it's a tab basically. So here I will be able to see on the left hand side, the owners of the app within my organization. And uh, on the right hand side, I will be able to see the app belonging to that particular owner. Again, that same logic, you select the app and then you add a permission to that particular uh, app. Okay, or fund app. Now, if I had Orphan app within my organization, I would be able to see over here. And then from here, I can uh, add the permissions by selecting that uh, Orphan app uh, and assign it to a different owner. Alternatively, I can also delete the, delete the selected app if I no longer want that app within my organization. Uh, in this box, you can also search for apps. So if I type in uh, some information, uh, then technically it should uh, show me all the apps within my organization. Okay, but you need to be uh, like this particular thing uh, here. I, I don't see anything because I'm in my orphaned app context. But if I go into say environment and if I just type Girish, you know, I will be presented with all the apps with regards to uh, user Girish. Okay. Uh, and it, it search for the name, first name, as well as the current owner as well. That's why you see a couple of apps which are, you know, like does not contain the word in the app name, but it still uh, has the owner name uh, with that list. OK. OK, so that's it about uh, set app permissions app. Thank you.